All right, boys, we got one nest down, so let us continue pretty much right where we left off. I'm a little low on ammo. Hey, it's another one of these things. And actually, real quick, while we got a second, we're going to look at... What is... I guess blues, because I've gone through it before. Maybe? I forgot, to be honest, I'm not even going to lie. I completely forgot that I even had this thing. What is this thing? This is cool, though. Okay, well, we'll look at look at this. Oh wait, there's the yellow. So it goes down across. Okay, 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 okay. So it's it's across the bridge. I was like, I know that there's a yellow here somewhere, and then I need to go downstairs at some point too. Okay. 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 Well, oh, wait, a minute, but there's oh, but that's only the side of the blue door. Oh no, I think that's another nest. Okay, so I think those things are nests. Okay. Anyways. We'll get to that in a second. Um, I need to do some more glory kills on the possessed soldiers. And I need to find more collectibles, but I don't know how to find the collectibles. So we'll do we'll deal with that in a second. Uh, speed recover. Bigger boom. Uh, charge. I don't, really don't use a charge burst. Um, micro missiles. Ammo efficient. Reduces the ammo cost of micro missiles. Ooh, cool. Fuck yeah. Let's do that. Um, then... Charge efficiency decreases the time it takes to power up a charged energy shot. Uh, decreases the energy recovery time for a pistol after using a charged energy shot. Most people using the charged energy shot. Ooh, these could actually be pretty useful though. Charge efficiency. Well, let's see. I use a shotgun more often, so let's do something like. Oh, I don't have enough actually. Okay, so screw it. Let's go to the pistol. Let's do. Um time let's do decrease the time it takes to charge okay okay the rest of them are all going to take three um the suit uh what do i got on the suit power effectiveness these upgrades improve the effects of power-ups <coughs> um when power-up wears off a damaging blast wave is released bucket yeah let's do that okay and then we need to look at this database uh argent energy okay so early in the development of the argent accumulator discovered the argent plasma compressed into hayden radius spheres named after samuel hayden would retain its structure when charged with enough radioactive isotopes once formed if a surface tension of the plasma sphere is broken the energy cache contained within will quickly discharge energizing anything it comes into contact with um, Argent caches wait, were the forerunner of the Argent accumulator, but their vulnerability to blunt force makes them uh, makes their use too unpredictable. There are still hundreds of these prototype Argent caches to be found around the Argent facility, and have become somewhat a collector's item among UAC employees. <laughs> if you find an Argent cache, please report your finding to the Department of en Departmental Enforcer. Oh, I'll I'll totally do that, boys. Heavy assault rifle. Okay. I think the pistol looks really cool. Um, okay, okay, okay. So, Hell Knight. The towering brute bred for combat deep in the bowels of hell. These diabolical beasts are the prized gladiators of the demon horde. They relentlessly stomp towards the target, smashing their massive fists into the ground to create shockwaves that stagger their opponent and leave them vulnerable to bone-crushing melee attacks. Hell Knight's powerful legs allow it to leap across large distances effortlessly, quickly closing the gap to its enemy. Holy crap, yeah. Any sane human would not be able to stand a chance against this thing. Um. Oh, jeez, look at that. These guys are crazy. Hellraisers. Hellraiser is an, as, as an astute and tactical foe that will engage enemies from a distance with a powerful beam of unrefined hell energy. The beam emanates from an arm-like protrusion composed of cartilage and other osseous tissue. Articulation of the cartilage... Artic yeah, uh, wait. Yeah, articulation of the cartilage allows the Hellraiser to focus its energy beam into a single charged shot that will obliterate anything that stands in its path. Holy crap. Artifacts, tutorials... Um, combat rating. Prisoning combat will now reward weapon upgrade points. Find and kill as many demons as possible during a mission to maximize your combat rating. You can track your combat rating progress on the top of your right of your helmet's display. Okay, okay, so that's what that thing is. Okay, so in other words, just keep killing shit, and it, I'll do great. Um, okay. Okay, so I need to go that way across. 
the bridge. Right, yeah, I need to go this way. And then up these stairs, if I remember correctly. Jesus Christ! And I, I, okay. Okay, alright. Well, uh, well, boys, I might as well just finish the job. I'm um, really? Am I seriously just. Thank you. What the hell? I was just walking on the surface of plasma. Wait, did I do it? Okay, cool. Demonic threat reduced by 25%. Oh, I gotta do the weapon grade on points again. Uh, what did I do? The. I did the pistol, I think, didn't I? Okay, oh wait, no, it already did. I already did them all. Okay, cool, 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 cool. So I'm gonna worry about that. Yay! Alright, let's go, boys. Hey, what's up, buddy? Hey, what's up? How you doing? Die! Okay. Alright. Alright, that's time I know. I'm just so damn used to having to freaking reload everything I do, like, all the time. Okay. Yeah, here we go. Now I get in. <gasps> What's this? New weapons. What is this? What What the hell is this? Pretty sure dexterity. Plasma rifle? Ooh. Uh, we can send it um, advent of argent powered electromagnetic accelerators based on the... Whatever the fuck that is. Design of the early 21st century. The weapon delivers a rapid salvo of plasma and inflict both impact and thermal damage to the target. Oh my god. Cool. Oh, uh, cue to activate the weapon selection wheel and choose from all your available weapons. Oh, so I can totally... Oh, okay. Cool. Alright. Well, we'll see Stay how this focused. goes. Stay committed. I... D okay. Sure. I'll stay... F I'm totally focused, boy. I'm totally focused. I, I can do this. What is this? Who's the personnel? Samuel Hayden. Wait, wait, what? Samuel Hayden is the chairman of the UAC. But that's so... Wait, so that is... That was Samuel Hayden. I just assumed that that was... Uh, what is it? Vega. What is the wealthy and powerful Hayden family? He completed his master's in theoretical physics at Oxford University. He showed prodigious talent in several fields, including thermodynamics, electromagnetic theory, and nuclear sciences. Young Age, he established the Samuel Hayden Foundation, a philanthropic organization dedicated to sponsoring young scientific talent and funding scientific programs in schools and colleges. His daunting intellect made him a prime target for the UAC, and they recruited him soon after he was appointed direct general director of the Global Science Council. Holy crap. Um, Samuel took over leadership of the UAC a few months after the discovery of the Argent Fracture, and immediately put the Argent Tower into production. During construction of the Argent Tower, Samuel was diagnosed with stage 4 inoperable brain cancer. Samuel was given six months to live. He dedicated those last few months to finding a radical solution to his mortality, cybernetic transference. Holy crap. That's actually kind of cool. I'm not going to lie. He's like, oh, you think I'm going to die? Yeah, go, go fuck yourself. Wait, is this? Oh. Okay. Ah. Got him. Ah! Oh, no, 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 no. could have gotten two I could have gotten the last two freaking um glory kills I needed that's a damn shame okay oh well, come on I want these okay um okay, let's go this way 
Hey, hey, whoa, chill, chill, chill. Oh, is that? Oh, no. Uh, hey, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. Gotcha. Okay. Can I? Aha! <laughs> All right, boys, let's do this. <laughs> Come to daddy. Yes, yes, yes. Come to daddy. <laughs> oh, that, oh, it took up two for that freaking ass? Oh, come on, man. Hey, come back here. Why, why are you running? <gasps> nope. Oh, jeez. Oh, uh, I'm stuck. Boys, I'm stuck. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, where'd he go? Oh, it's a buddy. Hey, whoa, whoa. Wait, where'd he go? <laughs> oh no! no. Oh, uh, 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 uh. Got him! Hey! Hey! <laughs> okay. Reduced by fifty percent. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, anything up here? Oh, what's this? Map and data. Environment's foundry. Foundry extension wing of the resource operations and first Mars outpost. Was this, uh, was this processes all of the heavy metals mixed mining, uh, like Marshall landscape around the original location. Ardent fracture, refining agent, ardent plasma requires a large amount of transitional metals and noble gases. So a central location that can be systematically cleansed and decontaminated is required to keep ardent energy production at maximum efficiency. As such, this area is considered a high-risk area, and all UAC employees are subject to regular med checks to ensure their production capabilities are not degraded by the environment. That's a funny way of saying that they're okay. Industrial accident-related deaths at the foundry dropped dramatically in MTC 2146 thanks to the implementation of the new AEC per safety protocols where employees exposed to dangerous materials are immediately sent to Lazarus Labs for cleansing, re-education, and, where possible, reintegration. As of this protocol, officially uh, reported deaths have dropped to negligible, negligible amounts. Jesus. Man, these people are like, they really liked, you know, working people to death. Okay. Give me that. Okay, so that's a way down. Let me see if there's anything else over here. Because it was just this map, I think, right? And then basically I can just go back the way I came. Okay, so let's go this way instead and see what's over here. Ah, it's a blue door. Okay. Let's go, boys. Hey, whoa, 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 hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Chill. Hey, none of that. Yeah, these people are assholes. Yeah, I can see that. I can see all the success around me. Oh, it's just like a shortcut just to go in. Oh, no. Close. Close the door. Close the door. Close the door. <laughs> no. Ah! <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, Jesus. See, see, boys, that's how you do it. Stay calm and rational, and everything will be perfectly fine. Nobody panicked. Nothing happened. What's this? Oh, okay, that's that way. What's this? Okay, that's another thing over there. Okay. Yoink. 
Did I get hit from behind? Oh, hey. Nice, nice, nice. Oh. Got him. Okay. Oh, oh no, no. Uh. Got him. Oh, suck it. Okay. All right. We did it, boys. We did it. 75%. Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. We will establish a new paradigm. There's still so much. The okay. Anyways, go this way. Um, dexterity. These upgrades affect the speed of certain actions. Switch weapons faster. I mean, I, I really don't need that. Oh, it doesn't matter. I don't even have any points for that. Okay. Okay. Explosive shot, bigger boom, speedy recovery. Removes the loading time for an explosive shot. Oh, I don't know. Let's do speed of recovery. That'll be infinitely useful. Tutorials. Uh, weapon switching. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. Alrighty, boys. Alrighty, boys. I'm going to go and end it right here for tonight. Uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell button. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Bye.